Hello everyone, welcome back Sagittarius. This is going to be a reading for all Sagittarius placements, okay? Alright, so let's get right into your message Sagittarius. Let's see what's going on. Alright, so what's the important message please? The Sagittarius here. What's the important message? The Sagittarius. What's going on? So we have answers. You will resolve your current situation soon. You will find unique ways to stand out. You find a new opening with job security. So you fig you figuring you getting the answer, Sagittarius. You're receiving downloads on which way to go, how to proceed, how to move. Don't worry. You're receiving. You're you're gonna resolve. Everything is gonna work out. You're gonna you're gonna you're gonna get some sort of answer that you that you're looking for. Okay? Or something that you wanted to know or something that you're trying to figure out. Something like that. You're gonna get the answer for it. Okay, so let's see. So we have the world and the four principles. So yeah, once you get this answer, you won't be able to be held back anymore. I'm also getting here too. You're um you don't have to save you save your money for something anymore. You get to buy it, like you finally get to buy it after a long period of time of waiting to buy something. You finally get to purchase something. This cost is a lot, maybe with the ten of pentacles here. Okay, but let's see what's going on with my Sagittarius. So the Wheel of Fortune. So you yeah. So a major shift is happening here. What's going on with Sagittarius? So the Knight of Pentacles. I'm getting something just slows down. Okay, what's the what's the Knight of Pentacles? The Six of Swords. So I feel like what's over is like whoever, whatever was holding you back, that's over. Whatever was taking you a long time to progress, that's over. But we have the nine of swords, the seven of swords, and the devil. The high priestess. Nine of swords, seven of swords, devil, high priestess. But it seems like whoever was plotting, they feel guilty, they feel sad, or they feel shook now. Somebody is scared and afraid. What's, I got to clarify that nine of swords. This nine of swords. Well, who is this that's in this nine of swords? Who the magician? Who is this nine of swords? Who is this? The hierophant. It could be a Taurus. It could be somebody like a, a real estate agent is what I just heard for some of you. This could be somebody who owns some sort of apartments, complex. You're going to get some sort of answers about that. Let's see. What's this? I just want to see what was that nine of swords about. But let's see. What is the, what's the four of pentacles here? So we have the two of wands and the lovers. I feel like too, you couldn't decide about a love situation or you needed answers when it comes to some sort of relationship, a love situation. But I feel like it was you was fighting to get the truth for this at first or something like that, but now you are you're seeking the truth. It's almost like you're getting answers about love, about manipulation, maybe about you getting just answers. So a lot of things that, that you didn't see at first, you're starting to see. Okay, so let's see. So what's this Wheel of Fortune, though? What's, what's this? No, what's the Five of Wands? What is this fight about? Or what is this disagreement here? What's the Five of Wands? You also could be fighting with an earth sign, maybe, about some sort of choice or choices or pathways or something. So I see you having a conversation with a lover about money. There could be like some sort of disagreements about money or something like that. Y'all will find an answer for that. Three Pentacles. You also could be trying to build something with someone, too. I'm, I'm getting you trying to miss business with pleasure. Don't do that, Sage. Okay, I'm, I'm getting that might not end well with the five of wands. You end up fighting or there might be some heartbreak. Secrets might be revealed. Judgment, high priestess. What's the um, Wheel of Fortune? So 
So we got the six of wands. So whatever shift this is, it's a good shift. Whatever you're, whatever answers you're receiving, King of Wands. Here you go. It's a good. It's something good. The Nine of Swords. What's the Nine of Swords, King of Wands, Six of Wands, the Ace of Wands, and the eight, the Queen of Wands. But I just feel like the answers. You, it's like you want the answers. You receive the answers, but when you get the answers, it's it's causing you stress heartbreak or it's just making you it's hard for you to get up and get moving or something like that what's the nine of swords ace of wands yeah the the eight, nine of cups eight of cups eight of swords yeah it's like you walk away from something was better left unknown or something like that because now you feel stuck trapped you feel like you wish you would have never known something you get the truth about something when you find out it, it kind of like Mm, what's the eight of cups the eight of wands the high priestess yeah the three of swords Damn. yeah i'm getting you're getting the truth or you're finding out a secret about a father figure or a lover but once you find this out it's 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 it, it, you, it's hard for you to move on from it. You think about it a lot. What's what? What's this? The judgment, the two of pentacles, and yeah, I'm getting you. The judgment, two of swords, two of pentacles. I'm getting you like, damn. I just wish I now. I just wish I would have never asked to get, bring this to light or some shit like that. Because see, what the thing is, I feel like you're asking for answers for something. But once you get the answer, it's not really the answer that you get. It's the extraness that come with the answers that you receive. Like it's more than what you think or it's something is deeper than what you think. And once you do receive the answers, it's like in the most harshest way. So it's like, yeah, you you okay with receiving the answers because you like, shit, that's what I wanted. I wanted the answers, but you're like, damn, I didn't know it was that crazy or that deep or I didn't know I was going to receive it like that or something like that. Yeah, you was like, damn, I didn't know that she was going to hurt that bad. Or, damn, you like, I didn't know. Or some shit like that. So, the night of four, yeah, something really got you real, like, real mad or angry. Some shit like that. Damn, is that serious, boo? I don't know what this is. But, I'm getting this is something you wanted. You wanted the answer and you got it, boo. So, we have the hermit, the strength. This could be about a Leo, a Virgo. I feel like too you trying your best not to say something. I feel like too this shit just gonna make you wanna ghost the ear sound or this Leo or this Virgo. You like I'm just I'm gonna ghost this person. Okay. Yeah, you could be finding out something about your daddy, the moon, the emperor, the ten of pentacles, maybe something about your father's side of the family, something like that. Yeah. All right, so let's see. What's um, what's the what do my Sagittarius need to do here? Okay, so the Eight of Swords. They say you gotta get out your head, Sagittarius. Get out your head. Stop overthinking the situation. The Five of Swords. Let this shit. It's saying let it motivate you. Let it make you a beast. Let this whatever this shit bring. They say let it make you a beast, baby. Bring little justice in the death part. Let this shit make you let. Let it change you for the better. That's what they're saying. Purely. The death and the just, justice. Let it change you for the better. Keep going. Go receive new love, new feelings, new... You know what I'm saying? Go go move on from the situation the best way you can. The hangman. Yeah, move on. Move on away from the delay. Move on from just hanging about, thinking about the situation. I am getting somebody that's going to want to apologize for the sneaky shit they did or some shit like that. <laughs> you could be like, who gives a fuck? Fuck the apology, of course. Y'all could be saying something like that. Alrighty, let's see. What's the message? A lot of clarity, a lot of sneaky shit today. I did three readings today, you guys. You should see all three on today. But it was a lot about hidden shit, sneaky shit today. Answers, receiving the answers, and so forth. So let's, let's see. Let's see. What's the message here? 
Okay, ignite ignite your soul. Embrace the mis mysteries of life. Stay open-minded and embrace the wisdom that unfolds from every experience. We have carried away. Yeah, somebody has got too fucking carried away or some shit. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know. It says veil of illusions. Yeah, something is all an illusion or some shit like that. Yeah, you need to get your key. You need to get clarity on something, Sage. Okay, my love. But that's what I got for you, boo. I will see you in this video. Bye.